Five, four, three, two, one. Only is go. <laughs> <laughs>
you could dare say I've picked this thing down to its bones. Nothing worthwhile left on this to take. Nothing worthwhile that I need anyway. I've chucked everything in the back of the F1 at the moment, all the metal panels. Um, I'm not going to pull it all out again, but I needed the rear parcel shelf basically for the boot hinges so I can fit them back onto the hard top they've been cut out. So that's all there, that's in good condition. The amazing thing about this car, as rusty as it was, the amount of metal I salvaged out of it that wasn't rusty. Like, I wasn't going to save these inner guards, I didn't really need them. The VG hard top's been cut out for tubs, but once I started to peel back some of the material, I found that the inner guards were pretty much rust free. This one's got a little bit here. The other one's got nothing. So I went, you know what? Let's get them. I can always cut it down the middle and stick a strip through there and just reuse them. It's, they're going to fit perfectly. You might as well, instead of remaking everything. The boot, the wheel well is perfect and it's been cut out of the other one. So that's going straight back in there. I picked both inner guards because the hard tops had them removed whether I put them back in or not I haven't decided yet but I got them anyway and I also got this rail on the driver's side because they do have issues normally here's the other rear inner guard like the outside's toast but when you look at the inside it's perfect there's nothing it's not rusted on the inside where the outside was fully rusted away there's no rust here at all it's hardly even fitted and the other piece I got, which stinks really bad, my neighbours love me at the moment, is a perfectly good fuel tank. So I'll be able to reuse that in the hardtop. So yeah, there's so many bits and pieces that I was able to salvage. And um, it's just the gift that keeps on giving. And the old seats, well, I ended up putting them in my VE. They're all right. They came up okay. They're not perfect, but they're the right ones for this car, kind of. A little bit of a Mexican blanket over... And the rough bits but yeah salvaged everything the back seat that was in this was excellent and that's going in the hard top and that's why i took the seats ahead of this i decided to keep the diff out of it i may need it it's a good diff from what i can tell and i've also kept the front discs so i might better use them on something we'll see definitely worth keeping the old 245 and the transmission, they're put aside for now. I have no plans, I have no use for it right now, but hey, I've got a space for them. And the word on the street is from a reliable source, these bad boys are good for about 10 PSI stock. So you never know. Here is the dash assembly, just taking that as a whole unit. I'm obviously gonna need a lot of that. The actual shell itself is rusty, but I've got a good one, but everything else, is uh, reusable obviously the steering column kept that salvage the complete heater assembly that's going to go in the uh, hard top and up here there's just boxes of bits and pieces that be put into the hard top or just put away um, a lot of stuff in bags keys ignition switches everything like that all the nuts and bolts to bolt everything together so yeah there's heaps and heaps and heaps of stuff there's nothing left on it really that I really need. And the seats that were in the VE, like I said, have gone into the hard top. The back seat's excellent. And these front seats will do until I find something better. So between everything else that I've got going on, little bits of progress are good. Can't wait to get into it. We're getting there. Had to do that sedan first. And now I can take it to the tip and have my car trailer spare so I can go and pick up that green VC ute which I'm looking forward to. Well that'll go on the back burner. This is priority at the moment. So anyway, that's it from me. Stay tuned. Be good to your mates. Like, subscribe, all that stuff. And I will see you on the next one.